what's going on everybody jake the happy snake here and welcome back to jake wants to be a millionaire yesterday i got the 64,000 pound question wrong for the second time this week so i won 32,000 pounds which was pretty good and that was converted to $32,000 and that brought my overall total to $62,587,442 so we'll see how today goes let's get to it here we go here's the first question for 100 pounds what number to the dozen means at, at a very fast rate? 19. Hundred pounds, here we go for 200. What in one's cap is said to be an achievement to be proud of? By the time I finished reading that question, I already had the question right. Okay, 200 pounds, now we're going for 300. Which famous train ran between Paris and Istanbul from 1883 to 1961. Orient Express, there we go. For 500 pounds, which is a fur hat worn by certain regiments of the British Army? Busby. It must be Busby! Wow, that was really corny. Anyways, that's 500 pounds and never going for 1,000. What was TV detective Kojak renowned for sucking? Uh, I... No, I'm sorry. That was so bad. Um, lollipops. <clears throat> there we go. That's a thousand pounds. And that's guaranteed. Very, very nice. So, got through the first five without needing to use a lifeline. That's always nice. Now we're going for 2,000 pounds. And here's the question. On what in everyday use do the words dickus at Tottenham appear? That would be the one pound coin. Final answer. Okay. Very good. All right. So this is just like yesterday so far. I got through the first six without having to use a lifeline. I like this. I really do. All right, let's take a look at the 4,000 pound question now. Which film features the song, You're the One I Want? Grease, I'm pretty sure it's Grease. Did I not get this wrong recently? Yeah, I'm gonna say Grease, final answer. Awesome, okay, good. Got through the first seven where they having to use the lifeline. I really, I really like this. Okay. If I can get this next one right without having to use the lifeline, then I'm going to be in really good shape to win at least 32,000. Here we go. 8,000 pound question is up next. Diamond and graphite are pure forms of which chemical element? I think it's carbon. Let me 50 50. Final answer. Yes! Oh my gosh! Woo! Okay, so I didn't actually have to use the 50 50 there, but I'm glad I. I, I, I honestly, I, I'm kind of glad I did because I wasn't overly sure about that. Alright, good. 8,000 pounds. We're going for 16,000 now. This is going pretty good so far. 16,000 pound question. What type of numbers are first, second, and third? Well, the only thing I can rule out is prime. I'm not good at this kind of stuff, but I know it's not prime because... Because... Well, one can't be a prime number. I know that's not really what it's saying. Um... I'm just going to play this safe. I'm going to ask the audience. Because this has been a decent game so far. I don't really want to screw it up. So let's just play it safe and ask the audience. Um, okay, well, I don't think it's prime. So that is a pretty close percentage. But I'm just going to go with ordinal because... 
that's just what I think it must be. Yeah, okay, good. That percentage was scary. That was like a 4% difference, but I was pretty sure it wasn't prime, so. Okay, we got 16,000 pounds, one lifeline left, six away from the million. Here we go for 32,000 pounds. <clears throat> Which member of the royal family is also the Duke of Cornwall? Um, it's either Charles or Andrew. I'm going to say Charles. Final answer. Oh my gosh. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Oh man, I was so scared to do that, but I'm glad I did. Holy crap. 32,000 pounds guaranteed. Five away from the million. We still have the phone a friend, so this is good. We're going for 64,000 pounds right now. Which island is famous for its more than 600 tall stone statues in human form? The... Easter Island? I would say, well, I would say either uh, Easter or Christmas Island, but you know, I'm just gonna go ahead and do this. I, I'm not risking anything on this. We're gonna afford a friend. It might be St. Helena. I don't know. Clearly I have no idea because I'm just going around. Easter Island, okay. That was my original instinct. Easter Island, final answer. I'm surprised that the phone a friend actually gave me an answer. Thank you, phone a friend. All right, sixty-four thousand pounds. That what that was my my instinct, but I, I was, obviously I wasn't overly sure about that. All right, good, sixty-four thousand. This has been pretty good. We're four away now. We're going for one hundred twenty-five thousand pounds. No more lifelines. But that's okay. Here we go. Question twelve. Who's the Roman equivalent of the Greek goddess Athena? I have no idea. I'm not risking it. It's been a good game. I don't. I hate to ruin good games by me being stupid. So. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with 64,000 pounds, honestly. So. That is converted to $64,000, and that brings my overall total to $62,651,442. So that's it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I will see you all back here tomorrow to end off the week. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out.